We're here. We're finally here. This is the one, ladies and gentlemen. This is the wrong trousers. <laughs> All right. So first off, just watching this after a grand day out, uh, a, gr oh, no, no, a grand day out, you can already tell there's like quite a bit of improvement and growth from the last one. The characters, the characters look on model. The lighting is better. The score is also better. There's just, I feel like they decided to put more care and effort into this one. And man, does it show. Literally everything about the wrong trousers works. The characterization's great. I love how we get to see more Gromit. We didn't know much about him in A Grand Day Out. But here, we get to see like more development for him. We get to see like his kind of jealous side. And like, we're, we root for him whenever he discovers, like, um, whenever he's suspicious about the penguin. Oh yeah, Th that little fuck, that penguin. <laughs> uh, I don't know what else to say, he's just, honestly, I think he's probably the best Ardman villain. <laughs> I think um, Ray Fiennes' villain from Curse of the Were-Rabbit is number two. This penguin's number one. No doubt about that. Wallace is also really great here. And do I even need to talk about how phenomenal and beautiful that grand finale is? Whoever thought of the idea of of like a, a train chase where Penguin hol is holding it, trying to shoot at Gromit and Gromit just pulls out like a box of infinity track and just lays it all around. Should probably be running the world at this point. I mean, how, how perfect can, like, how can you top perfection like that? And the spot and the heist scene is also just like very is, is very intense. It, it's so great. The animation here is also better. I already mentioned how the characters are more on model in this one, but there are also other great things and, and little details, L like, like the sweat coming down from the penguin whenever things start to go wrong. And just the... And the kind of bullets hitting the light the thing on top of grandma during the train chase uh, i cannot get enough of this this is probably one of the best pieces of of, of british filmmaking ever the wrong trousers is a perfect example of like doing something that's charming short and all around <laughs> Just something well made. I know I still have one more left, but I think this is easily going to be the best out of these three. Now, I'd like to hear what you guys think about the wrong trousers. <laughs> Let's talk down below.